How to unlink iPhones sharing the same Apple ID. Hello and welcome to our video tutorial. Today, we're going to discuss a commonly asked question. How do you separate your iPhone from your spouse's iPhone that's currently sharing the same Apple ID? This can be an issue when you're receiving each other's calls, messages, or other data that you'd prefer to keep separate. Why should you use separate Apple IDs? First off, it's important to understand why you would want to have separate Apple IDs. Apple IDs are designed to be used by one person, and they serve as a gateway to Apple's various services such as iCloud, App Store, iTunes, and FaceTime. Using separate Apple IDs helps you maintain your own personal data, settings, and purchases. Steps to create a new Apple ID To separate your iPhones, one of you will need to create a new Apple ID. Let's guide you through that. 1. On your iPhone, go to Settings. 2. Tap on the top bar, where your Apple ID, iCloud, iTunes and App Store information is displayed. 3. Scroll down to the bottom and select Sign Out. This will sign you out of the current Apple ID on the device. 4. After you've signed out, you'll see the option to sign in or create a new Apple ID. 5. Select Create a new Apple ID and follow the instructions to set up the new ID. How to keep shared content Now, you might be wondering, what happens to our shared content like apps, music, or books? Apple has a solution for that. It's called family sharing. With family sharing, you can share iTunes and App Store purchases, Apple subscriptions, and more with your family. 1. Go to Settings and tap on your Apple ID at the top. 2. Tap Set up family sharing, then follow the on-screen instructions. You can invite up to 5 other people to join your family group. And there you have it. You've now successfully separated your iPhones and can maintain individual control over your personal data and settings. Hopefully, this video has been helpful in navigating through this process. Remember, sharing is great, but in the realm of Apple IDs, it's beneficial to keep things individual. Thanks for watching and happy iPhone usage!